All right. Uh, hello, everyone. Welcome to match five of the Terraforming Mars League. Um, we are about to get going uh, and uh, should be an exciting one. So here we go. Let's see what we got here. I hope we get Mining Guild. Oh, nice. Mining Guild. I love Mining Guild. Okay. Let's see here. Any tiles? Any tiles? Nice. Um, this looks like a good hand. Uh, let me just see what other other corporation was. Tractor. Tractor with no earth tag. So I think this is a clear mining guild. Uh, medical lab is awesome. Uh, restricted area also awesome as a tile. Um, and shuttles as a discount. So. Yeah, this looks sweet. Let me throw in the uh, high GL. I'm going to apologize to um, the people in the chat. I sometimes don't do great looking at the um, at the uh, comments, so I, I will try to do so, uh, but I, I will make no guarantees. Um, I'm going to take Radcam simply because it's it's a it's a building tag. Um, I think I'm going to take Noctis City as well. This one is more speculative, but it, it could be okay. Um, if I take that, that will give me enough to play restricted area and buy a card with it. So I think that's pretty good. The question is GHG. I mean, you could make an argument that GHG is actually even better than Noctis. Um, But, you know, I generally am not a huge fan of, uh, of terraforming. I, I mostly like to play science tags. <laughs> Let's go with this. This is going to be fun. Um, all right. So OK. We got invention contest and uh, thanks, David. Thank you. I will need it. Uh, this has been a really great league. All the players are really strong. So um, yeah, Klaus, I, you know, GHG is not bad. I know it's okay. It's probably better than Noctis, honestly. But um, I, uh, I don't know. I, I like these kind of slow build-up type of games, and um, that's just where I'm at with it. So. So the question is, where do I, where am I going to play the restricted area? Obviously on some sort of tile. Uh, I think I'm likely to take steel here. Interesting, interesting placement for Tharsis. Um, I'm definitely going to take, I wonder if he misclicked. <laughs> that would be funny. <laughs> um, I, I'm going to play restricted area here on a tile, and I guess I'll just play it on... I guess I'll just play it on Tharsis Tholus. It gives me another second tile here. I don't know, maybe that was lame. Um, okay, let's draw a card. I wonder if it was a misclick, but... Okay, fish is good. One nice thing about Mining Guild is that uh, I've already got two building tags. Um, medical Lab is nice with the starting off with two building tags. All right, well, we'll see what we get. Just anything with tiles, obviously, is going to be great for the start. I, I Honestly, I usually put restriction area down here, and this might have been a better spot. Um, I don't know why I, I chose to do it up here. Just I liked it, I guess. I don't know. Um, I guess it's a little more protected if you get, uh, what's that science tag? That's a natural preserves. Unlikely somebody will take this spot. That was the it was the pressure, the pressure of having to choose. All right. 
So any tile, natural preserve would be amazing, obviously. Also power would be good just to help us get some uh, building tags out there. Um, okay, I mean, fuel generators, not bad. I mean, it lets me turn on Radcam and Noctis. I don't like passing, which way are we passing? Even down, I'm passing to TJ. I mean, passing him IO, I don't think I can do that. All right, I'm gonna cut IO there just because he did nothing on turn one, which means he's just primed to go off with that. Uh, I will take Lagrange. I mean, another con contender would be Ironworks. Um, yeah, I'm gonna take Lagrange there though. I just just have more science tags. Now, Mohol is interesting here. That's a card I can play. Um, hey, Thread. Yeah, I'm gonna take Mohol here. That's actually a good card for me because it it it's gonna give me heat production and boost my uh, uh, my. Uh, my my uh, steel production. Wow, fuel generators came around. So that's nice. I, I mean, basically, I'm just going to spend the first few turns just making a bunch of building tags here. So I'll take Lagrange, Mohol, fuel generators. I need to make sure that I can play Mohol here. So I should, yeah, I have plenty. I've got eight steel. So this will be good. Um. Yeah, Thread, I think in that situation, I, I'm curious what your thoughts are, but I, I don't think that I can pass IO to, to, to Phobolog when they've spent nothing on turn one. Like, that's just too, it's too good of a play. If he doesn't have any good cards, that, that just, like, gets him back into a game that he might have just not had good cards for. Yeah, I think, I think that was the right play. And, well, I wield the, <laughs> the card I was thinking of taking out of that pack, so I <laughs> think it was the right one. <laughs> Um, so definitely going to get Mohol down, and I, I guess the question is, I have a pretty um, steel-heavy hand right now, so I think I'll probably put it on steel. Um, it does leave Titanium open for Phobolog later, but um, let's go ahead and draw our card first and see what we get. Whoa, Earth Catapult. Nice. Okay. Um, well, that's sick. So I guess the question is, do I just take a turn off then? I don't think so, actually. I mean, I'm going to be able to pay for this mohol. Yeah, I think I just play the mohol. It comes out cash even because... Um, this would have discounted it too, but this boosts my my steel production, so I might as well get the um, I might as well get the um, heat production going. Um, that's a sick card. <laughs> Thread Thread's hoping I lose this one. Um, I still, I still am actually shocked that I managed to take a game off of Thread. Um, thank you for allowing me to do that, by the way, Thread. I'm sure you're going to be fine. All right, so... Yeah, it takes the Titanium, which I think is the correct play against the Mining Guild player. Oh, and also had the follow-up for the two cards, so nice play. Um... All right, so I think I'm just passing here then, and we'll set up Catapult. Um, so I'll have 27 cash next turn, and I guess I'm basically just taking a couple turns off then. Maybe go for Planner. Let's see here. How many cards does... So Tharsis has very few cards. I'm going to pass my turn. 
So maybe I go for planner builder. I mean, I have a good setup for that. Um, I've got three building tags. We got four or five. Okay, asteroid mining. So he had he did have the follow-up there. I'm glad I didn't pass him uh, IO. So I guess the the last piece of the puzzle for me right here, I, I feel like I have a very good starting hand here is going to be improving my card draw just a little bit. I can play, I think I'll actually be able to play Catapult. I can actually play several cards this turn. OK, I'm passing up this time. This is a tough one. Titanium Mine is definitely good. Um, I also really like Business Network here, just because of the way my hand is set up, that's going to be really good. So if I pass, if I pass, if I take Titanium Mine, I'm passing to stand by on this one. Then I'm trusting that he'll cut imports from Phobolog, and Phobolog will take Business Network, and I'll get urban, Urbanized Area. If I take Business Network, then Phobolog ends up with another Titan. I think it's early enough in the game that I probably just take Titanium Mine. It's also a building tag, which gets me closer to Builder, and I need Steel Outlets anyway. I, I don't know, I, that's a tough one, because the card draw is really good. Um, definitely going to take tech demonstration here. Um, I will I will keep that and play that later. That's going to ensure that I have some cards later in the game. Maybe I'll draw a media group or uh, optimal arrow breaking beforehand. That's a card I can just sit on for a while. So, okay, so let me think here. I'll just cut big asteroid. Will I take big asteroid? I do not think I will. Um, So I, actually, I can only play one card out of it. I can only buy one card if I want to play Earth Catapult this turn. Oh my gosh, Business Network, are you kidding me? OK, well, I guess I'm just not playing anything this turn. I'm going to go for, I'm going to take the turn off then. So if that's the case, then I'm going to go Mine, Tech, Asteroid, and Network, take them all. And I'll buy a card that'll put me at 13 cards. And I'll try and go for Planner Builder. Can't believe that came around. So do I play Business Network then? Take a card. I don't think I'm going to. I'm going to wait one more turn. Uh, I don't want to take any hits to my economy right now. and I, I don't really want to be spending more. I want to save all the money I can so that I can have an explosive turn when I finally do, hopefully next turn. So I'm going to want to play Catapult. I guess I could play my, I guess I could play titanium mine. It essentially pays for itself. And I don't have to spend any cash. It'd be really annoying if this guy's got asteroid mining consortium. Thing is, okay. I'm gonna not play it, no, mostly because I don't want to get hit by asteroid mining consortium. And the thing is, 
I'm going to get a, a two off discount on that card when I play Earth Catapult, which will essentially account for 60, 66% of the value of the Titanium Mine anyway. And if I spend money on that card, I will have to buy another card to try and potentially to get Planner next turn. So I think it's actually better for me to not play that card, even though that's a little bit odd. Um, typically, I would play that card now. But I'm going to take a turn off here. And we're going to get Planner. And then, and then I'm going to unload my hand. And I might be able to unload my hand next turn in a way that forces Phobolog to pass before I play Titanium Mine, just to protect against Mining Consortium one more time. I hate that card. Everybody knows that I hate that card. Hey, Pike Minister. Yeah, this is a, a tournament game. It's um, it's the fifth game of the tournament, but the uh, actually week four because we kind of played them out of sequence. Um, so the only thing that would make this hand better now, I mean, I've got I've got uh, decent economy. I'm gonna have catapult. I've got plenty of science tags. I think everybody knows. Anti-grab. We need anti-grab or AI central. Um, all right. Okay. Greenhouses, open city sponsors. Well, I like sponsors with Earth Catapult. I mean, obviously greenhouse is great too. One city on the board. I guess I just take greenhouses. I think that card has more potential. Okay, robotic workforce. That's going to be good on. Uh, actually, it's pretty good on mobile. Gives me a heat bump every turn. I think I will take robotic workforce. Fusion power. I don't think I have any power. Well, I'm going to have one power tag. Definitely not taking Lycan. I am going to need power in this hand. I've got a lot of cards that use power. Question is, is fusion power worth it? It is a, it is a, um, a card I can dump steel into, which is good. And I need to take three total cards. I guess I'll I just I'll I'll consider it. I need to take two total cards because I'm gonna draw a card off of uh of uh I think I'm gonna skip fusion power. I mean it is it is decent, but I'm definitely taking greenhouses, I'm taking robotic workforce. I think I'm gonna skip power. The problem is you need to play two power tags anyway just to play it. And by the time I play my second one, I'm I'm sort of less likely to need it. On the other hand, you could say that it is a steel outlet, and I'm gonna have a lot of steel in this game. I'm gonna skip it and keep my money here. So Yeah, regretfully, I'm not going to have enough money to do what I was hoping to do, um, which is fund planner and then play um, Earth Catapult. Um, I guess I'm taking one more turn off. This time, this time I'll, I will probably play Titanium Mine. And business network. No, just the titanium mine. I think I've got enough cards. Hey, David. By the way, thanks for giving us the extension on this one. I, I I'm uh, I meant to respond, but I couldn't figure out how to respond to you on that. So, um, 
Thank you for giving us the extension. So I'm going to fund. Well, I mean, honestly, let's see here. He has five cards. He has nine. I don't have to fund uh, Planner now. I could just, if I draw a card, play Earth, Earth Cat, and then use some Steel, it's actually pretty good. Yeah, I'm going to do it that way. And then I can start inching towards Builder, too. All right, so let's go ahead and draw a card and pass. I just want uh, TJ to pass the turn. I guess he doesn't have any money for um, Asteroid Mining Consortium. Okay. So I guess we'll, we'll hold off on funding Planner for one turn. We'll get Cat down and we'll start building some economy and some building tags. Play the Catapult. Actually, let's see here. Yeah. And it's 16. Yeah, we'll play that. And then let's get the mine down. I don't want to get too far out ahead of my skis here, but um, question is, I'm at 14 cards. I'm going to draw one next turn. So now I'm buying one. I could play fuel generators and rad cam. For another boost of two to my economy, two more tags. I think I'm just going to wait here. I, I am hemorrhaging some value here, but um, I think it's okay. I'd rather not have to buy cards that I don't want out of this one. It's it's more worth it for me save that money nice okay so i'm passing to standby i'm definitely going to take imported nitrogen here. that card's awesome this is the type of deck that or this is the type of game that's going to be good for me i think um i hope he cuts the jovian How many building tags? I got four building tags now. Oh, I forgot to do my heat bump last turn. <laughs> okay. Well, not my tightest game. Um, I just wanted to save it, you know, essentially uh, try and get that heat uh, boost. Yeah, that's what I was thinking. Um, okay. I definitely, I mean, sabotage is good here. I just hit some titanium from TJ. Um, power infrastructure, also a really cheap building tag, but I'm at four, five, six, seven. It's seven building tags when I play all those. Um, this is a second power tag. I don't think I need that. I passed the card that requires the second power tag. A little bit of a tough, tough one. I mean... Yeah, I'm just gonna take the sabotage. I, I'm just money poor right now anyway. I can't I, I can't afford to be sabotaged. Um commercial district, interesting. Okay. Yeah, I'm gonna take it. That's a good card. Um it's a it's a outlet for steel. Again, I'm gonna be blocked up on power here. I'm gonna need to find a way to get some power. Maybe I should have taken that other one. We're definitely taking nitrogen. Wow, business context too. Really see a lot of cards. 
But we'll take the sabotage. Will I? Cash poor right now. I mean, it is, it's 12 cash from him for three to for me. I got a lot I want to do with this money. Um, I like commercial district, but I have so many things I need power for already. I'm going to skip the commercial district. These are good players too. They're not going to give me a spot. I, I'm, that's going to be awesome. I, I don't know. I, that could be a mistake. I do like that card. I just worry that we're going to, we already have a lot of stuff to play. And, and I want to start, you know, doing some stuff. All right. How many cards? He's got 12 cards. I am going before him next turn. So I can actually delay planner one more turn. Well, we'll draw a card. Probably Robotic Workforce or Titanium Mine. I guess I could Robotic Workforce to heat, but I don't think it's worth it at this point. I'd rather just have the money mine. Um... And I think we'll business network and we'll draw a card business network. And then I, oh God, I wish I had taken that mining right or the, uh, okay. <laughs> I just said that these guys wouldn't do it. And I, I literally had the commercial district right there for three points. Um, Crazy. Okay. Well, let's see here. So we've got Terraformer, Nair, Gardener, Builder, Planner. Draw a card. Let's give. Arrow break. Not good. All right. So what am I going to do then? Maybe I just play a bunch of building tags and play medical or uh, medical. Actually, I could um, I could hold. Here we go. Here's what I'm going to do. I'm going to play out all these building tags and then I'll hit it uh, the uh, medical lab with my uh, robotic workforce. Just gain a bunch of money. So I think that what I'll do is I'll just take the I'll take the planner milestone now. And okay, so he's going for. Gardener doesn't have that much money though, so I should be able to get them both. Planner, give. I'll play the next two together. This is four. Okay, so I'll go. Fuel generators, rad cam. Yep, he had it. That is irritating. Well, guess what, buddy? I'm taking your three titanium next turn. Um, so go fuel generators, rad cam. I'm one tag short to get my...
That puts me at six tags. I need to play one more just to make sure I control builder. There's four cities on the board. And I don't want to spew out greenhouses here, but okay, so this is going to take me five. I'm going to fire off this tech demonstration here and just see what I get. Research an immigrant city. So, Thinking about whether or not I should play greenhouses here. I mean, it, it's it's a pretty lame play. If I had a way to get more plants, it's not it's not bad if it if it ramps me to putting a plant here. It's not bad, but it also gets me one more money production. It's actually going to be two more money production because if I play robotic workforce on medical lab, it's going to be another bump on that too. Let's business network. Do I have enough here? So I have 12, 17, so 11, 15, 16. I have exactly enough to at least see a card. Let's just see the card here. If it's a good card, it might change what I do. One crater. Don't think so. It is a good card, but take the heat bump here. Um, all right, I've got to make a decision. I mean, the problem is he's got nine cards. It's so likely that I play this and then he just hits the plants. That That's the problem with this play. On the other hand, if I don't draw, if I don't draw a, a, a steel card in my next four, I have to do this anyway afterwards because I can't let the round get to standby or he's going to take Gardner. I think I'm just doing it. So this is, I have 12, 15. Yeah, I think I'm just doing it. Just, it doesn't feel great, but um, this is what's happening. There you go. All right, well, we will now have planner locked up or a uh, um, builder locked up here. So we've got two awards or two milestones, sorry. It's gonna be pretty good. And we've got nice card draw and uh, oh snap. Look at that. All of these cards are good. And I'm obviously taking AI, although Space Elevator is also good. And sucks passing that to TJ. I 
I can't pass an AI though. How many tags does he have? Two, yeah, definitely not passing an AI. All right, well, interesting. Space station or ice asteroid? The space station is going to be good. More discounts. I wish I could play Ice Asteroid because this will give me the plants I need. I mean, the thing that sucks is that Space Station is exactly the kind of card that you want in the in the Earth Catapult deck. I don't want to just pass giant ice asteroid over so that he hits my plants. And also, giant ice asteroid is not optimized by... I'm just going to take this one. I, it, uh, it's just annoying that I have to take that one. But um, Hey, Dictator. Yes. The epic. My fear has happened, which is, oh, snap, local heat trapping. That's actually awesome for me. That gives me a way to turn this heat right now into a plant. I'm definitely taking that. I'm going to have to fade one, one turn because I'm not giving up the milestone. Okay, so let's see here. So I'm going to take AI. I'm actually going to pass Giant Ice Asteroid. It's just too expensive. Like, it's a good card, but I don't, I don't really need it. I'm kind of doing something else. Um, now, on the other hand, it is just a good card. All right, maybe I'll take it. I changed my mind. So make sure I can afford all this. Yeah, I'm going to take those. Okay. Um, all right, so I'm going to start by taking Builder, and then I'm going to pass. And I'm going to hope that my plants survive. If they do, uh, then I'll be, able to, I'll be able to take advantage of this spot up here and get my, another bump to my economy here. And I want to save enough money for robotic workforce. Okay, Inventors Guild Mining Rights. Okay. Ooh. I'm glad he went down there. All right, so I'll hit some titanium from him, and then I'll... Uh... Well, no, I'm definitely going to just... Uh... If, if my plant survives this next phase, I will definitely just play the plant up here while the getting is good. I'm just hoping that standby cut water imports from TJ. It is annoying that this minus five is going to throw me off, off the, uh, the like this the sort of you know pace of getting a heat bump every other turn. That is pretty annoying, uh, but the the value is too high here. Okay, research outpost. I'm gonna hit my. Well, that I guess that solves that problem. All right, well we made it, so that's that's sweet. So let's go ahead and do that. Our plants. This is a nice play.
feel very fortunate that those plants survived. All right, so uh, now I guess we will look at cards. Do I, would I be willing to sell any of these cards? Arrow braked. Sponsors. All right, so if I look at a card and I want to buy it, then I would have to sell two cards. And I really don't want to sell any of these cards. Well, I guess it'll depend on how good this card is. Search for life. Got two science tags. I've got my third coming. Four. Five, six. I definitely don't need science tags. I'm not going to take search for life. That means that I can buy a card here because I can always just sell arrow break to ammonia. All right, well, let's hit his titanium first. Um, all right, so I can buy a card because I'm planning to sell Aerobrake Ammonia. So I'll still have enough to robotic work for it. Aquifer pumping. Do not need that one either. All right, so let's sell. Um, arrow break ammonia. There's really no world in which I'm playing that card. And then let's go ahead and play and let's hit uh, this guy here. Plus four. All right, that was a good turn. We are we are definitely not crushing production, but the the Earth catapult is going to be doing a lot of work in this game. Hey, Opal! Uh, just because we have a lot of cards to play, and so that that value just adds up. Um, okay. I really like gene repair. This may be a game that I just want to end, though. I mean, got a lot of production. I guess, like, if I took almost at 5%, so I'm gonna hopefully be able to play this soon. I'm just gonna cut the comment. Um, okay, nice, advanced ecosystems, I will definitely take that. Um, It's true to cruise. I mean, 
that's a good point. The issue is just that I'm a little behind on production. Um, I'm not getting crushed on production, but I'm, it's, this is not great. So TJ's got, this is 20 credits per turn. So he's at 20, 26, 27, 28, 29, 30. Um, i take these two. And I'm at 4, 10, 18. So, I mean, he's outproducing me a lot, although I do have Earth Catapult. Um, so that that ends up being a not inconsider, inconsiderable amount of resources. Um, and he's got good card draw too. So it's not, even though I have a good setup, he also has a good setup. Um, that's even more production for him. So I don't know. Um, <laughs> we have ethics and chisel. I mean, I can't argue with that. That is def that's true. That is amazing. Um, what are my next priority? My next priority obviously is to get AI online. I basically just need a power tag for that. So hopefully we will get some power. And now I'm sort of regretting the decision not to keep the tectonic stress power earlier. Um, I also had an opportunity in this draft that there was an opportunity to get the um, the one that lets you make energy, the little space thing. Because I, I actually would love an energy card because uh, I'd like to play shuttles too. All right, landlord, that is not good for me. Um, Cupola City, I mean, I like these cheap cities, but I don't have any power for them. I've already got Immigrant and Noctis. So I'm going to decline that. Yeah, it, just, it doesn't do enough at this point. I'll draw a card. All right, I'll be right back, gentlemen and ladies. All right, Inventors Guild and Nitro Pillar Mons. I guess we're just going to be relying on our ethics and shizzle in this one. Um, all right, what card did we draw? Asteroid. This will be nice next turn. Uh, we can play this to uh, try and get the heat bump. Gosh, we just really need power. Um, Am I going to standard project a power here? Really bad. Get AI online. Or do I wait one more turn and hope to get a power card? I guess I could play Lagrange for research. Um, all right, what if I go research into mass converter? All right, I'm doing it. YOLO. I don't know if that was a good play, but I'm feeling lucky. No, nope. those are good cards. Um, Miranda, how many first tags do I have? Two. And I really want power to get shuttles down. I think I'm just going to take one more turn off. Uh, 
uh, it, it's a, uh, I mean, I could just buy a power and play this. I think I'd have to sell one card, but I'm going to wait one more turn to get AI online. Kind of sucks, but I just like the value I get off AI is somewhat mitigated if I'm just spewing off money to get it going. And I, and I really want shuttles active too, because I have all these space cards. Um, yeah, dumpster a little bit. I think where this is leading me is going to be to just end the game quickly playing all these space events. Um, but I do need some power. Um, I'm going to pass here and just see if I can get some power on the next round. I mean, the advantage of doing that is that it's going to also prevent Phobolog from having time to really take advantage of that economy. And I have 10 points and milestones, which is good. Um, So if I can just like crush the TR, uh, that might be good. Okay, so, man, several of these cards are great, but Peroxide Power is exactly what we needed. I hate passing Decomposers, because that card's awesome. But Peroxide Power completely sets up our turn. It lets us play both Shuttles and AI Central. And, um, and, and then it's just gonna let us essentially go for a, a steady stream of these space events, which will boost our economy. And that was a good draw. Peroxide power is really good. Um, also, the fact that I can pay for it with steel is great. I've got a lot of money going into this hand, into this round. Do I have any other earth tags? Um, oh my gosh, are you kidding? God almighty. Which way are we passing here? I'm passing to TJ. How many tags does he have? Four space tags. Got to take viral enhancers though. All right, and there's the tech stress power. I'm gonna take that too, because I've got a lot of power cards and that card's actually good in our hand. Okay. All right, well, this is gonna be a race because I had to pass TJ of another five boost to his economy. He's going to have essentially infinite money. Oh my god! <laughs> Decomposers came around. Okay. Um, all right. Combo unlocked. I mean, we're taking all of these cards. Um, that, that was a sick round for me. Okay. So we've got a lot to do this round. This is going to be a sweet round. Um, okay, so what are we doing here? What are we doing with our lives? Um, so I am going to stall this out a little because I don't want people to hit my power. And I'd rather play, per I mean, I guess, I guess I could play, um, I could play tech stress power to protect against uh, someone, but I, I don't want to. I, this is so much cheaper, and I've got a lot that I want to do this turn. All right. The nice thing is that I don't have any plants yet. Okay, converting the plant. Greenery. All right, so he gave me the heat bump, which is nice. So I'll go ahead and take that. I'll pass. So I don't, I don't know, dictator. Um, okay, I just want some, some steel. I mean, he's got infinite money. Um, 
but we have a pretty busted hand here. I, I, I am not going to lie about that. This, is, this hand is busted. So it's just a matter of, I, I feel like this is just a matter of sequencing, but I, I mean, we shall see. I definitely don't have like an amazing economy here. So it, it's possible that I just get crimped on time to play all these cards. Um, Lightning Harvest. I don't think we need that power anymore. I think I've got enough. Not going to take that. So my plan is to get definitely want to get shuttles online and AI online this turn. And then we'll, and then I'm, and then it looks like just a parade of of uh, space events until we get closer to the end. I guess Noctis is where I'm going to be building my city. Not a horrible place. Hey, Private, you have a league match. I don't have a, well, let's see here. So probably had to work today. Um, man, kind of a bummer. I would like to get that heat bump if I could, but I don't, I don't think I can do it in sequences the way I want to. So let's just draw our card. Pets. Good one too. And he's definitely got the Jovians going. I just hope he doesn't get the multipliers. Uh, I suspect he has two, at least one, potentially two. So we'll go, what's he down to here? He's still got all his money. I think AI is more important to get online. I'm going to play that now. If he hits my other power, I, I mean, the other one, obviously, I'd like to play um, shuttles, but I'd, I'd rather have uh, AI on if I had to choose. And if this comes back around to me, I can play shuttles into um, Asteroid to get that other heat bump. He's just going max titanium production. I am going to have to end this game. But I, I think this is going to actually, the way this is shaping up, do this. Definitely gonna hit his plants. Let's go ahead and do asteroid here. I lead off next turn so I can try and get get these uh this plant engine set up draw some cards
Okay. Wow, Demos too. I'm really set up for just ending the game. So let's see here. What if I go? I really want to get that decomposers, viral enhancers. What I'm thinking about is whether or not trying to get Miranda Resort down just for a bump to my economy. Um, but if I do that, I want to play pets first. That two would be bump of three. I mean, the natural way to do this would be to go, I think I'm just going to wait, because it, it makes more sense to go viral, decomposer, pet. Then play Miranda. And I'd rather spend Honestly, I'd rather spend this titanium on um, getting these big events. Like, I think the next one I want to do is giant ice asteroid. Or actually, probably big. Uh, probably overthinking this. I don't think I really need to. I don't need to do that right now. I'm just going to save my money. There. There's no reason really to play. These other cards, let's see how many, I don't have any, I have one plan. Pack. There's no reason to play Viral Enhancers. You can, I, I guess the only reason to play it would be to try to lead off next turn getting pets down in case another city is played. I think it's pretty unlikely that the city comes down. I, I, I mean, I guess unless there's like Phobos Space Haven or something. I think I'd rather just have the flexibility of having a little more money. Um, that's debatable. It, it, it could have been better to set up the the leading off pets play, try and make sure I don't miss a pet. But I mean, I, the advantage of doing it this way is I might draw Eco Zone. I think that's actually a reasonable argument. Um, wow, these are good cards here too. Definitely taking Mars University here. And I'm passing to, yeah, that's fine. Mars University is great for me right there. I have a lot of cards, so I'll be able to cycle. Um, okay, kelp farming and investment. Kelp farming is awesome. Definitely don't want to pass that. I would love the investment one, but I'm going to take the kelp farming. It, it's just good here. And I, with all the just plant combo stuff that I'm going to be doing here, these are good. Um, I'll just cut the photosynthesis. I don't care if people heat trap me at this point. So 42 cash. Uh oh. Okay. All right. So I'm going to take kelp farming and Mars University. Still have a few science. Yeah, I've got plenty of science tags to play. Um, I don't need those other ones at this point in the game. Honestly, kelp farming might be late too. I I, I maybe should just be pushing into just like um, ending this game. I would like to hit these plants. If he has a way of getting plants, it's uh, 
But let's go ahead and uh, look at our card. Nope. And let's just draw two cards. Eco zone. All right, called it. Um, called my shot. The question is, I think that I can actually play these. I don't have to play them now. I, I think I'm better off playing these space events and then unloading all that stuff later. So why don't I start with Maybe I play Big Asteroid into Comet. Yeah, I think I'm just going to play these space events now. I can this whole like um this whole plant package, I can just do it later. It would be nice to get kelp farming on, but that's not even I'm not even able to do that now. So let's just do big asteroid. And then let's just raise our TR as much as we can. Save Deimos, obviously. I don't think I have enough for giant ice asteroids. So we'll play Comet. Hmm. I'd like to hit max plants on that one too if I can. And maybe I'll slow up on that then. So let's see here. Draw my card. Nice. Okay, Ganymede. Just so that means he doesn't have it. So there, there's been three. I've seen three. Um, oh, I don't have a. Oh, I do have a plant. Yeah, I, I've seen three um, of the multipliers now. He might have one. One of them might have made it. So I think. Underground city. All right, let's see if we can start a little light on here. So you guys can all see my beautiful face. As I figure out a way to, to lose this game. All right. Um, banker. Anchor good for me. Um, plants are not great for me. What money? Yeah, I have enough cards actually. Okay, I'll just take that. All right. Um, all right, I'm going to get. 
Mars University down. Let's cycle away. Aquifer pumping. Still me. Oh no, it's DJ. Um, all right, how are we doing on score here? I think. I think maybe right now I'm losing DJ or standby for horse punch by maybe a decent margin too. Um, have to catch up on that on that regard. I will score a lot of points off this plant and um, as long as I have enough money to do it. All right, so I'm going to get enhancers down now. And I'll cycle. Food factory. Actually, food factory could be good for me for. Um, I want to get rid of any of these cards. All right, I'm going to cycle that. I don't love cycling that because the, the deck could wrap. Um, We'll play decomposers. Um, I mean, the guy did Asteroid Mining Consortium me. So I'm not feeling too bad about it. All right. Um, oh, crap. Um, I forgot to put down EcoZone. So I think I'll wait on Heather. Um, we'll just do that next turn. All right. I got distracted there. Um, yep. So we will take that card, it's money neutral. Just gonna cut dev center. Lord is banker. Have any explosive banker thing, so and landlord I'm definitely not getting. Media group's nice. I'll definitely take media group with all the events that I still would like to play. Those two. Okay. I do want to get Eco Zone down and I want to get pets down. I don't think that many more cities are coming down. I did miss a pet on here, but I will gain it back by playing Eco Zone in the order. Um, I 
Okay. Protected halves. Man, this would be a nice DMS here. That's 16 points on board. <laughs> TJ's pissed off. I do know that feeling, although I will say, I mean, we hit a lot of his plants, but I mean, he did asteroid mining consortium you know, with a boba log on like turn three or four or something. Like, I mean, he, he made a lot of money off of that. And it actually is going to hurt me in this game because um, I've got a lot of, I've actually have a use for all those space events. Um, I guess I have a few economy boosts. Like I've got this Miranda Resorts. It's going to be like a boost of four, I think. Maybe five. Okay. Ugh. And more cities. At this point, it might actually benefit me to slow down because I think Stand Standby Horse Conch is actually ahead of me right now. Um... Well, um, I guess I could just ego zone here, try and cut off more good plant spots for him. He also has 11 plants now. I mean, I could just take a plant from him. Pretty tempting, but it would take most of my turn to do that. I'm going to have opportunities to do that. I'm going to do this in the right sequence. Um, let's just let's just draw my cards here. Yes. Do I, actually, I think I will will want that because I'm going to need steel outlets like that. He's going to get that plan down, but I'll, I'll get the next one. Oh boy. So I guess I'll spend the rest of this turn just kind of setting up. Right, he did have the water imports. I'm surprised that made it through, but that is not great for me, but I think I think I'm far, I'm going to be far enough ahead of him. I don't know. I, I feel like if I lose this one, definitely on me, because my cards were sick. So <laughs> I really got no, no excuses on this one. That asteroid mining consortium play is it really hurts though. That's a big uh, that's a big swing. All right, well that's nice. This gives me a um, a spot to play my eco zone for cash back. I'm gonna go ahead and do that now. All right, the point parade is going to start here. I'll go for I'll get the media group hired raiders play next. The 
16 BP. I mean, TJ is a lot of points. Um, yeah, I've got literally zero board presence, so th this one could be tough. <laughs> um, I mean, I do have strong cards, but this one could be could be tough. Um, I'll get the media group. Oh God, I've, I don't understand. He's building so many cities, it doesn't seem good to me, but I have not gotten my pets down. It is definitely costing me now. I mean, weirdly at this point, I think it is, I'm incentivized to go after TJ because if, if standby just runs away with the game, then uh, I'm fighting for second. Yeah, pets is still a point. Yeah, it, it is not great. Um, probably better to just play out. It might be time for Noctis, honestly. Like, I don't want to put these things down. I don't really have any other reason to spend the the steel. So I'm going to go ahead and play the pets. I know it's not like amazing, but it triggers all my stuff and it, it gets a point on its own. Oh, it's still my turn. Okay. Um, I'm going to go ahead and take my heat bump. And then let's go ahead and get Noctis down. Or do I want to play kelp farming? That's obviously a really cool. Yeah, probably just kelp farming. I could play kelp farming and uh, moss. All right. Do kelp farming here. Um, all right, so what's better here, Moss or Heather, if I play this? I actually probably could sell three cards, maybe. I don't really want to sell many of those. Um, well, I'll play Heather because that's going to let me play my plant thing right now or whatever. Sold that.
take points away from their player. Um, right. I might just play a food factory, like, it's fine. And I am going to want to get it on down for banker anyway, so I might as well just get the money. All right. All right. Well, the point train is starting. I uh, I do. I am gonna want to play Noctis in this game because I'm gonna want a couple places to put plants. I guess I have Immigrant City too. Um, he's gonna get a lot of points with plants. I'm gonna be bummed if I lose to that. Um, mining area. Everyone is gone. Mineral deposit. Small animals. Do I have a lot of steel that I'm going to need to use? Yeah, I, mean, I think I have a bunch. This nets me some a bunch of money. Small animals does trigger everything. I'm gonna take mineral deposit. I, I think I think I'm just gonna want more money. Small animals is good though. Ooh, cartel. That's actually good because oh, zeppelins too. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. How many earth tags do these guys have? One and two. So cartel is basically a dead card for them. So I'm gonna take zeppelins. It's a little more expensive, but it's a, it's more. Uh, I'm just gonna cut that. It's a little bit more expensive, but it, um, one, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. I'm going to have another city nine. It's, that's going to be a big bump to my, um, it's 17 and I'm at 13. I have a chance that I could win banker. I, I mean, I'm sure he's got something to take advantage of that, but we just saw two of the big ones right there. This game's going super long. And I don't really know what to make of this game. Like, I'm going to want to get Immigrant City down here. just to have some spots to score points with plants. Um, I make money on that now with Media Group, right? No, I don't. What am I thinking? Pay three, get three back. The only use for that would be fish. I don't think there's any other. Yeah, I'm gonna I'm gonna be off that one. All right, let's see what we drew here. Lava flows and underground detonations. Oh. Right, so they're just trying to end the game now, which I think makes sense. Standings in Banker. Um, standby is ahead, 17, 13, 7. 
I do have quite a few ways to gain money in my hand. I think what I'm going to try and do is just, just hit all of his plants to start next turn if I get that option. He's got a lot of plants on the board here. I'm going to lose to just like spamming plants. It's going to feel bad. Oh, he played that well. I'm going to get his plant now. Oh, he did not. Definitely not protecting those. I mean, the weird thing is that I kind of want to play these other things. I'm not sure I want to rush the game. But Demo saying is seems strong to me there. I think I'm still going to have opportunities to do that. I'd rather just... He's got enough plant production that I'll have an opportunity to Demo if I need to. Birds. That's what I wanted. That's going to be awesome. Okay. So... Let's go ahead and birds. Let's go ahead and set, uh, mineral deposit here. All right, so Would it be sick if there was a city that you could play on an ocean tile? <laughs> um, question is, where do I play Immigrant City? Or, or at all, or if at all. All right, well, he made that. No. I mean, he might get there with it. All right, I'm going to go ahead and I guess I'm just going to go ahead and birds here. Start getting this going. I'm guess I guess I'm glad that I waited to play Zeppelins. I'm kind of wishing I had gotten that. But I, the, the, what I'm struggling with here is trying to decide whether or not I need more than than just knock this city as a city. Um, how much money is he stockpiling here? Quite a bit. I think I am going to want two cities because I'm going to end up with a lot of plant production. Um, all right, I got to remember, I have the mangrove too, although there's just really nowhere for me to take advantage of that. Bushes. Um, I guess, I guess I'm going to play, I 
I don't know, he's throwing me off here a little bit. I mean, the question is whether or not I'm trying to get Immigrant City down. I mean, if I had known he was going to standard project 10 of them, I would have done it sooner. Um, I guess the question is like, so if I knock this here and I place some plants around me, is it worth having another city here? Maybe. I mean, it's also good on Zeppelins, and it gives me some things on my. All right, I'm going to try it. Could be bad. Perfectly willing to admit that this might be a bad play. Um, Um, if I do that, I'm going to want to, I'm going to want a moss. Thanks, Q. I'm going to want a moss. And so I think my next three plays are Moss, then ecosystems, and then insects, which will give me a big boost to my plant production. How many tags do I have now? Like four, so it'll be five, six. So let me soak up some points on the board. Most of the hate cards are out already. I'll go Moss, and I might, if, if I can, I might sell enough cards to get Zeppelins going, if, if that's an option. Go Ecosystems here. All right, that puts me seven plants. All right, so then I'm going to go I'm going to play insects, so that leaves me seven, six, so I need, if I was going to play zeppelins, I would need to sell five cards. Oh, that's sick. <laughs> um, well, actually, I can play my plant here and get the money back. So let's do this. That puts me at eight. I need to sell three cards. I'll sell underground, physics complex, energy saving probably. Although energy saving could be sick if I just get like some random card. But I, oh, he had the satellites, 12. Oh, uh, okay, well. I want the money though. I got so many cards that I want to play. I'm going to take one and sell these two. And honestly, I could get yeah, no. one, two. I don't think I'm playing Ice Asteroid in this game. The 
27 to 22. Might be able to eke my way into landlord second. What's that looking at? Should be able to, to get second on landlord. Hoping I can get second on. I sh might be able to compete with that still. Um, well, I'm going to have to speed up a little bit too. Usually an hour is plenty, but I've, I've had a complicated hand and uh, this game is going to generation like 45. This should be the last round. Um, Artificial Lake's actually good. Um, actually, no. I'm going to lead off with Demos, obviously. Take the, the ocean bonus. Um, so I will not take that. Protected Valley, also, I don't need it. I'll just cut cards that could be good for people. Because I, I want to be playing all my big cards. And I'm going to run out of time to play all my big cards. I don't think I want any of these. Nope. I'm going to start off with Demos. That's pretty gross. Takes away a bunch of points. Um, okay, so let's start off with Demos. That's for money. It's going to take money. Tharsis with that. Play my plant in case anybody that for me. Man, there's so many cards I want to play. Um, I mean, nit imported nitrogen is a must. Uh, fish is a must. I don't think I'm going to be playing convoy. Regretfully. Hmm. Looks like I'm going to lose on uh, Anchor. Do I have any other ways to raise that? I guess I have knock this. I've got 24 points and I have 27 points, but I am I've got 10 on milestones. He has zero. I'm 10 ahead on TR. Question is, does the game end this turn? I, I guess it doesn't really matter for me. I, I just play good plays and then if it doesn't end. It actually is good for me because I have such I have such banger plays to follow up. Um, I'm one more one more plant away. Let's see here. If I hit knock this and one away.
and he made a lot of cities in this game. All right, I'm just going to draw cards here. See if anything else pops up that is going to be good for me. Noctis farming and our infrastructure. I think we've wrapped the board now. This is the danger. I may actually have helped Bobolog get into the multipliers that he needs. Still not sure if the game's going to end this turn. I think if I had been Tharsis, I would have been pushing a little harder in that direction. End it is what I mean. Okay. Question is, is he going to end it? How do these other awards look? Scientist I'm winning, thermalist. Definitely winning. I think I'm going to be second on them. Yeah, that's good. Um, <laughs> I guess solar wind power is kind of, it costs me one and I get to cycle a card. I think I'll probably do that. Because I'm going to use this titanium for sure on imported nitrogen. I'm not sure I even want to buy a card at this point. Um, Yeah, I'll do I'll pay one for that to get the cycle. But actually I could get money off of that, but flooding. All right, I'm gonna play an imported nitrogen. Good, definitely playing that card. Uh, yep, on decomposers. Goes on, I'm gonna put that on birds. All right, he's gonna have, um, well, maybe not. Maybe he doesn't have another multiplier because he, he doesn't have enough money. And is this going to go another turn? I mean, I guess he's he's saving the right to, to end it. Um, I think I do thread. I, I think I do have another time because the decisions aren't going to be super complicated, but 
Um, Play our plans. Definitely playing fish. It's a bubble log. Just triggers everything. I think he's thinking about ending it, trying to decide what's better for him. Colony ship. Mm -hmm. Well, it's a good card. Well, I'm certainly not going to end it. So, um, I guess a bit knocked us down here. Yeah, Thread, I think I might be losing. Um, but uh, how many tags do I have on that? Four? There are four. And why not? Now we're tied. <laughs> um, I mean, if he goes another round, I've got I've got good cards. How many cards does he have left? Two cards. And I think if he goes another round, it actually helps me. I think he his, it's his best play to end it. And uh, oh, he cannot. Okay. All right. Well, in that case, I'm going to make a thing and draw a card. Oh, that was good. I'm gonna cut that one. I mean, I have five minutes. I feel like that's that should be enough time. Yeah, small animals, good. Triggers all my stuff. I think I'm in second now. I mean, I like I, I think I'm ahead of stand. But um Investment loan, I'll take that too. Although, with the emphasis on, I mean, I have so much money at this point, I'm just gonna take it. But uh, so I'll I'll play large convoy. Well, I got a lot of things to do. I'm just gonna have to sequence everything quickly. I'm gonna take um, yeah, take that one, that one. That one. <clears throat> All right. He's going to lead off by taking two bumps. This will be the last gen. And then I'm.
Oh, he left a heat for me. Let's see. Is that is that a trap? Is he gonna catch me? No, he will not. I can take this heat bump if it comes to me. That would be a gift. <laughs> Private. <laughs> Well, I'm glad I put that city down now. As it stands. That's annoying. All right. Um, I can get this down here so that I actually have a place to play that. I'll take the heat bump. He's only got three cards. I'm hoping he doesn't have a multiplier. He's at 30 VP. I'm at 37 VP, 39 with my two pets. I have a lot of points to score here. Oh, oh yeah, okay, I knew I had that. Um, so the question is, how do I stand on, he's at 28, I'm at 33, I need to make sure that I win that one. And if I get the right card draw, if, if I get first on banker, I, I think I think that I'm a lock. Um, am I still second on landlord? Yes, barely. Is that true, David? It's possible, I just didn't have time to, to calculate it. Um. <laughs> thread. No, I just don't. I don't calculate it that carefully, and I, I could have, but I, I'm a little low on time, and, and I I had enough in my hand to do this next turn that I thought it would be okay for me. I guess the issue is like if if Bobolog finds a multiplier, that's obviously horrible for me. Um. I'm not used to the uh, league matches going 13 generations, that's for sure. TJ definitely played strong here because uh, he had, I mean, he had a good, he had a decent um, Bobo Log draw, um, but was locked out of milestones and. Um, Thread, why is that? Why am I at risk of breaking the game? Also, I can't live in fear. I mean, like, I, I'm not going to like not play. Man, he's going to get Landlord because of the spaces. I guess I can play Mangrove over here. It's tw he's up by one. I can play Mangrove here. You know what? No fear. Can't negotiate with terrorists. Um, yeah, TJ played great because uh, he's gonna he's gonna lock me out of landlord with really strong play. Um,
Well, I didn't know that, so I'm just gonna play it as if I didn't know it. And that's what I'm doing. All right, so let's do, um, ooh, insulation. Interesting. Um, let's go ahead and do this. Actually, six points. All right, I'll just play. He's going to get one more thing down. That's going to put him at um, two ahead of me. So I can play a mangrove over here. I should be able to tie. Oh, I don't know. <laughs> now he might get two. That's two more things. Hmm. Really need the green player to play into that spot. He is going to get to go first, so he'll get one there, maybe. Um, I mean, at this point, the, the score should be calculatable anyway. We're tied. He's going to play one more, and I should be able to play one more, too. Um, Oh, he got the toll station. Uh oh, did that break it? Oh, oh no, okay. Go ahead and play this. He's at 39, I'm at 35. Do I have any way to pull ahead there? I don't think so. Uh, actually. Forty. Ha! All right, I'm doing it. And I get to go ahead of him, so actually I can block him out. Kind of giving him some points, but... All right. Um... Why is that? I feel like we have enough that we should be able to calculate at this point. And like, what am I supposed to do? Like not play the game to, to win? Oh shoot, I thought that this rolled over. Um, so I thought I was gonna be able to lock him out there, but. Fred, I actually haven't been paying that close of attention. Um, 
Well, I have a minute left of my thing. I've mostly been focusing on that. I don't actually totally understand the locking out thing. Um, but I, I mean, what am I supposed to do? Not play a six point card at the end? Like, I mean, it's six points and I'm in a close game. Um, All right. What corporation am I? Mining Guild? Woo! Wow. I won by more than I thought. Okay. I definitely didn't think I was winning by that much. Um, but uh, okay, I'm now I'm back. Explain it to me. So what's? Yeah, thread that may be true, but I I honestly don't know what's going on with this card thing. I I uh, something about like I have to log out and log back in. I thought that basically I'd be threatening my own game because of my timer. I'm just trying to read the chat here. Well, what am I supposed to do then in that situation? Not play a card that scores me six points? Yeah, yes. I mean, if I had known that the that the game that I was winning by that much, then I would have, but I I didn't I thought it was closer than that. Um but if I time out, then I lose. So I thought the risk was on me, not on them. I don't see how that's rude for me to do that. <laughs> Thread, you know, I, I I wasn't paying that close of attention on that. I mean, I didn't I didn't have time to add it all up. That's what I have my wingman for usually. That's what I mean. Q usually does that, or Nima, or you know, whatever. But um, it was getting a little hectic there at the end. I mean, what do you want me to do? Math is not my. That's not the way I play. Here, here's the here's my logic. Okay, in my mind. I, I knew I was in a good position to win. I had a ton of points in my hand for the last round. I didn't have time to calculate the um, Lava Flows play on round 12. I definitely wasn't trying to troll people. If I knew I had the win, I would have taken it then. Um, but I knew that I had a crap load of points in my hand. So I, I move on to the next round and play it, and I just figure that I'm going to get through with all the points that I had in hand. So I don't know. I mean... Some of those things were swingy too. Like I, you know, like the I ended up winning Banker. Um, that's a that's a like a what eight point swing or something like that. I mean, six point. That's a six point swing. Um, I ended up getting second on the other Miles R awards. That's each of those is a four point swing. Um, I don't know. Those points add up. All it would have taken for him was to have one multiplier. He would have scored another 13 points or something like that. I mean, he had a ton of Jupiter tags. So I don't know. I, I um, you know, you got to, I don't know, whatever. Like, I mean, I don't, I don't think that like it can be bad etiquette on my part to play a card that's going to score me six points. Like, I, I mean, if that's a problem with the program, then that's the problem with the program. Like I, I would have taken my loss if, if I timed out or whatever, it would have been annoying to me, but I would have done it. It's fine. Um, you know, so I don't know, whatever. It's a tough one, but uh, that was certainly a fun game. I did not think that was going to go to round 13. So um But uh, that was awesome. That was super fun. Uh, I'm sorry. I, I know I got a little less interactive as, as time goes on, as, as I want to do, as it gets more complicated. Um, but um, I got to play my favorite corporation. We had a ton of 
ton of people show up to watch it, which was awesome. Thank you for all, all for joining. Um, that's a big win for me in the in the group uh, because uh, it puts me in contention. Um, it's, there's some very strong players in that group, so I still think uh, it's going to be unlikely that I get to make it out of the round. But um, you know what? One more win, uh, you know, I might be able to get in there, so that'd be fun. Um, anyway, I think that's all I got today. It is a gorgeous day in New Mexico. I think I'm going to go for a little run. Um, <laughs> well, thank you, KG. And, and I'm just going to say, I'm going to keep saying it out here because um, I would love to do commentary for the playoffs. If I don't make it, uh, Nima and I would love to, to join in and, and do some commentary. If uh, I'm sure many people in the chat here uh, will be in it. Um, and it would be super fun. I think, you know, like uh, the league is awesome. And if we're going to make it a little more profile, I mean, definitely – the uh, the league matches add a, a, a certain interest, you know, because they're stakes, even if the stakes are, um, you know, just bragging rights or whatever. But so uh, I would love to do that. It would be fun to team up with Hodge or, um, you know, I know a lot of you guys have streams and post videos and that would be super fun, too. So if you guys want to do that in the playoffs, just hit me up. It'd be super fun. And uh, yeah. So um, anyway, thanks, everyone, for watching. And uh that's uh, I'm gonna have to go smoke a cigarette after that one. Uh, felt felt tense to me, but um, thank you all, and we will catch you on the next one.